Yeah, mate, I thought those uh, guys performed really well uh, to get us that win just before the break. And, uh, yeah, it should be rewarded for that. Um, I think they've also trained really well through the uh, the break and you know prepared well for the game on Friday night. Yeah, I've got a lot of confidence in him actually. He's been here uh, probably for about three seasons now, and whilst he hasn't seen a lot of starting time, uh, you know he's been around uh, Will for the last uh, three years learning, and he's he started a couple of games, had uh, good memories from Melbourne last year, and we won that game uh, down there, and he scored a try. So, got a lot of confidence that he and Ben will lead the team around well this weekend. I think it was almost 12 months to the day when he started against the British and Irish Lions. I think he showed just how, how unpredictable in that game he can be. But you know, cer certainly for us, uh, they'll control the shape of the game well. Ant deserves uh, the opportunity to be named vice-captain based on uh, the way that he conducts himself around the organisation, the way that he, that he leads and his style of rugby. Um, I think it's important, uh, certainly with, uh, with Will and Quaid, not in the team, they've got a really strong presence to lead in the backs and you know, Ant, Ant does that well for us. So yeah, I think he, he thoroughly deserves the opportunity to be named as vice-captain. Yeah, the important thing is that this block of games, these three games to finish the season, that we perform well and that starts obviously on Friday night. Well, they're two world-class players, no doubt, and everyone else is going to really need to lift their game to, to, to get the results that we need over the last three weeks of the competition for us. Oh, we've got complete faith in Nick and Ben that they'll do the job. They've been there before and they've done the job before and we're confident as a team that we can work towards getting the results. Yeah, well, every game you lose hurts and there's no difference there. We hate losing at home and unfortunately that we did on the night. Um, we're obviously looking to turn around and get the result this weekend down there and yeah, just setting the record straight, I guess, and knowing that we, that we are capable of w winning those games.